Hello, hello. And welcome back to Hitman 2 and the finish line in Miami. And today we will be taking care of the Days of Thunder challenge, which consists of blowing up Sierra Knox while she's in her car in the race. And we can't use the sniping rifle for this one. We do need to use a specific bomb. So for this one we will be bringing with us just a lockpick and a lethal poison vial which will be for the uh, other target Robert Knox. So the only thing we really need for this challenge is the lockpick. So for getting this challenge we will also gain ourselves the backdoor engineering discovery or feat for simply picking up a key. And what's in this thing discovery or feat for opening the evidence locker which is in the security office at the entrance to the race. So, right from the start, off the bat, what we're going to do is make our way under the racetrack via the underpass, and we are going to go and take care of Robert Knox and get him out of the way with as quickly as possible. So once we're through the tunnel, we're going to hang a quick U-turn just to avoid the camera over there, and we're going to use our lockpick on the gate here. Once we're through the gate, we're going to make our way up to the top of the overpass, the stairway. Uh, on the way there, we will grab the lead pipe from the bottom of the stairs as well, just so we have a melee weapon, just to knock a few people out a little bit quicker. So once we get to the top of the stairs, we're going to enter into the Kronstadt building. And if no one is looking like they are now, we're just going to run straight through out the window on our right and up the drain pipe. This will bring us to the roof area where the satellite dish is. And just by the open window in the corner, we have the security room. And we're just going to wait here for the guard who sits outside to have a cigarette to return and then go outside again just so we know that he's only just left the room and we've got enough time to go in and take out his companion. So while we're waiting for this guy, basically he's going to stand there, then he's going to go and stand by the surveillance system before leaving again. And the second he turns around to leave and exits this room, we are going to duck through the window and knock out his companion as quickly as possible because he's about to move as well. So we want to get through the window and get him unconscious as fast as possible. We're going to pick up his shotgun that he drops and we're just going to leave it on the floor about there. And then we're going to grab his body and we're going to drag him right up as close to this partition as we can and take his outfit. Now when his friend returns he should hopefully see the gun and he will go to retrieve it and take it away which is only to the box in the corner of this room, but it's enough for our needs. So the guard has returned, he's spotted the gun, so we're going to get behind him and knock him out. And we're just going to leave him there while we take off the surveillance system. So with that all taken care of, we're going to exit the security room into the bathroom next door, and we're going to poison Robert Knox's eye drops with our lethal poison make our way out of the bathroom and all the way down to the end of the corridor remembering that there is an enforcer down here and we need him to be stood at the window which is where he's just made his way to so we're going to enter into the office mess with the air conditioning unit and exit the building so back down to the corridor towards the security office back out through the storage room onto the roof we're going to vault our way off of the roof and back down onto the overpass and we're going to run along the overpass to the other side of the track and down the stairs and we're going to head now for the main security office of the event site should I say uh, where we will retrieve our car bomb so all the way down to the bottom and just along a little bit we will find a door on our right we're going to burst through this door, be aware there are a couple of enforcers around, so use the crowd for cover, if they are about. I was lucky he wasn't around at that point. So we're going to run out of the entrance, 
hang an immediate left and into the secure car park and loading dock area and into the back of the security office through the window and in this basket we will find ourselves a set of keys we're going to grab those keys and that will get us the backdoor engineering challenge uh, when we burst into the office there grabbed the combination for the safe off the desk and in the room opposite we find said safe and in said safe we will find our car bomb and some notes we'll have that night stick as well that's going to come in handy and then out the window once again through the crowd we're now going to be avoiding a couple more enforcers so use the crowds wherever possible and we need to get into the underground pit storage area the changing rooms so we're going to enter in through the driver's lounge and straight down the stairs hang a left at the bottom through the changing rooms and we're going to grab this key card that's just here as well and through the other door out the other side and then just at the bottom here we're going to throw our nightstick at the bottom of the stairs to get the attention of the guard at the top of the stairs and while he's distracted we're going to make our way into the Kromstad race team quarters and round into the back area here where we we're going to turn off this generator and we're just going to hide here for someone to come along we'll select our lead pipe for when they do and a gentleman will come along shortly to turn the generator back on and when he does we're going to knock him out dump him in the crate just off to our right and take his outfit Turning on. so a generator's back on he goes off we're going to put his body in the crate here take his outfit and we're going to approach the pit bay area John, and while we're doing this, Robert Knox should be just dropping dead as we speak. You're the junior slip wrench who got injured yesterday, right? So that's Robert Knox taken care of. What we're now going to do is approach this console here and select the middle of the three options, which have means putting in the car bomb. And we'll go through our little cut screen or cutscene should I even say where we give the car a nice once over yep everything looks fine there away she goes and that was a 4.2 second pit stop so with that taken care of all we're going to do now is trigger the explosive at any point so what we're going to do is we're going to put on our bodyguard outfit once again and we're going to exit the pit area and we come out by the medical bays here and what we're going to do is we're going to make our way back round to the track and up onto the overpass area at the other end of the pit straight and we'll get a nice good view from up there I think so we're just going to run all the way there there are no enforcers to worry about so we're just going to make our way straight to the overpass stairs and up the stairs to the very top getting a lot of cardio on these stairs today so once we're at the top here we're just gonna stop around about here somewhere we get a nice good view and we're gonna wait for Sierra Knox and Moses Lee the two leaders to make their way around to the pitch straight and when they exit that last corner there we are gonna detonate the explosive and watch Sierra Knox veer wildly off the track to her death so here they come now, so we're going to trigger the explosive. Both targets down. So there you go, that will get you the Days of Thunder challenge. So all we're going to do now is make our way over to the end of the walkway up here, grab the crowbar, make our way back and back down the stairs and we are going to take the sewer exit which is just at the bottom of the stairs down here. So that is the Days of Thunder challenge along with a couple of the discoveries and feats for picking up a set of keys and opening a safe. I have been Anubis and I will see you all in the next video.